Hey, before this video starts, I just want to say, if you like this content, make sure to like and subscribe to my channel. Also, if you want a video of your own, make sure to commission me either when I'm live on YouTube, or you can DM me through my public Discord server. Anyway, let me not take up your time. Enjoy the video. Oh, um, g c come in. Uh, yes, yeah, sorry, I I wasn't expecting anybody today, because, well, I didn't really have anyone booked. Um, who sent you? Oh, it's you. You're the human that fell from Earth. Well, I've seen enough news to know about, well, you. I'm presuming that, uh, Lucifer sent you? Yes, well, I was honestly wondering when you were going to come to me, because he did say he was going to set up a meeting between us, uh, discussing about, um, portals and whatnot being opened. Yes, well, I've been told already that you've been to Osmodius about this whole situation, and, well, he's told you that I haven't really done anything for, you know, him. Opening portals and whatnot is usually for his work and, well, for his, you know, occupation. And, well, for me, of course, my grimoire, it can open portals to the mortal world, but I don't really hand it out to just, you know, random creatures and imps and whatnot to, um, you know, just willy-nilly open portals. <laughs> willy-nilly. Such a silly word. Yes, well, I am... Um, sorry, I'm... A little clouded in the mind. I've recently gone through something very um, heartbreaking, and I choose not really to discuss it with you know others. It's quite embarrassing, and I just <sighs> I don't want to talk about it. But, um, besides my whole personal life, how have you been? I know you've been causing quite a, a talk around town because of, well, the whole situation. I can tell you this, like, from me, personally, that I haven't opened any mortal portals or portals to the mortal world at all. I haven't touched my grimoire in a few months or so. And, well, I, since I've got it back recently, I haven't really done anything to do with, like, portal opening or anything like that. Although my uh, ex-associate, um, his name was Blitz, he has a company. He has a imp corporation. I don't really know what he calls it. I He's a basically assassins for hire. And, well, um, this is quite embarrassing, but if you promise not to tell anybody about what I've did with them, I promise you I could get you something very nice. I can get you some, like, I don't know, like, maybe money or something in return for keeping this a secret? Oh, oh, thank heavens. Usually when I talk to a human, they're usually terrified of me. But apparently you're different. <laughs> yes, well, okay. So, a long time ago, I was... 
starting to be in an arranged marriage. And, well, the Goisha are quite a popular and, well, rare type of people. Or creatures. I'm not really sure, honestly. But my wife, ex-wife, she wasn't really the best type of Goisha. She was, um... To put in the layman's terms, a bitch. And, well... When I was with this imp, Blitz, um... We had an arrangement of some sort. And the arrangement was... That... Every full moon... They have to return my grimoire... And for an exchange, it was more for a night of pleasure. Pleasure. <clears throat> yes. Well. Um. Well, that was the deal. After that night, they could have my grimoire for as long as they need for their company. And well. After that. Um, well, mm, recently, me and that imp stole us. Um, well, there was a fight between us because I needed my grimoire back permanently. And, well, I gave him an Osmodian crystal signed to his name. And... That Osmodian crystal could open portals to the mortal world at any time. And well, now that he's signed under Osmodius's jurisdiction, he doesn't really need me. And so we kind of s sent our own ways, and before he w went out, he lashed out on me, and it ate well. He showed his true colors because I thought of him so highly. And, well, he... I'm sorry. <coughs> I thought of him so highly even though he was an imp. Or still is an imp. He thought so low of me. To think that I was just another rich asshole, in his own words. I really did care for him. He didn't really care for me. So, we split our ways, and, well, he... He has his own way now of getting into the mortal world, and he can still work on his own duties and whatnot. Me and him are no longer a thing. Mm -hmm. But yes, it wasn't me who opened those portals. If you don't mind, I think that their building is not that far away from me. So, I mean, if you want to talk to somebody about the portals being open to the mortal world and whatnot, you could always ask them. Oh, well, um, there's, uh, four of them, if I remember correctly. There's Blitz, um, Millie, I think that's her name. Um, oh, what's the little one's name again? Oh, what was the little one's name again? He looks like a possum. Um, Moxie, that's his name, Moxie. And Stolis's adopted daughter, she's a hellhound. Oh, what's her name? Luna! Yes, that's her name, Luna. If you go down to their business building, which honestly has gotten a lot better looking than I've... I've seen it before, and, well, it wasn't very... It was like a normal office building, and now they've uh, gained a budget of some sort because their business is booming recently. I mean, good for them. I'm happy that their business is booming, but, um... Yeah, if, yes, if you want to have actual information about the portals being opened, you might want to go over to their building and 
ask for either Blitz or any other of the people that work at that company. Mm hmm. Well, um, it's been a good talk with you, um, Hell's Wanderer. Is that right? Is that your nickname, Hell's Wanderer? Yes, okay, well, that's a, that's a very good name. Well, Hell's Wanderer, it was a good time meeting you. And if you ever need something from me, don't be shy to come back down to this ring and knock on my door. One of my butlers would open the door for you and all you have to do is ask for me. And, well, you're more than welcome in my home. But if you don't mind leaving because I have lots of um, things to be doing, I'm very busy. Yes, all right. Well, you have a good, good day now. Bye! Ta-ta! Ugh. <sighs>